Thank you, Mr. Jan Ping. Thank you for the hospitality. First, let me tell you that uh, I would have loved to speak to you in Chinese. And actually, I almost could have. You see, what in my views makes life magical are those hidden connections uh, between present and past, between here and there, uh, between your own story and the story of the one around you. I mean, I wouldn't be here speaking to you without the boy you see on this picture, my father. Believe it or not, my dad actually happened to be raised in China by the Chinese family you see in the picture. His parents uh, worked for the railways as new lines were built here. And for a few years, he was left in care to this family. So my father was raised in Chinese ways, and his mother tongue was yours. It was long ago, other times long forgotten. But today, I can only regret not having learned from him the beauty that is Chinese. In many ways, today's fiat is similar to my father in that picture, a young child in China, full of expectations. It wasn't that long ago that fiat first visited China, and it wasn't easy. Like a child, we made mistakes, but we learned from this and went back to the drawing board. And that's uh, why we are here today. We learned about how Italian cars would suit the Chinese market. And we form partnerships that make us stronger. That's the fiat way. It's part of a young at heart approach to everything we do. An approach that uh, allowed us so far this year to already launch in Europe two new vehicles, the Fiat 500L and the Fiat Panda. An approach that inspires us to build cars that make Fiat the brand with the lowest CO2 emissions in Europe, and an approach that fuels us to now bring the most Italian of companies to new markets, like the US, China, and South Korea. And so far, the world is embracing our Italianness. In America this year, Fiat is off to a great start. We are setting new sales records every month. And uh, most importantly, we are now bringing to Beijing everything we've learned along the way. Because today, all roads lead to China. This is, after all, the biggest country in the world. And to capture the market's landscape, we needed to change perspective. Which reminds me of uh, one of your greatest poets, Wang Zhuan. The white sun sets behind mountains, the yellow river flows into the sea. So widen your sights of a thousand miles and climb further up one story of the pagoda. I think you say, U Tion Chen Li Mu Gun Chan Yi Chen Lo. Only 10 magic Chinese characters to shorten a thousand miles into a foot. So we widened our sights and shortened our journey to China. Because for everything that Fiat has learned about your incredible country, we believe that it shares a point of view with yours, with ours. <laughs> Italy, Zhongguo, Zhongguo, Italy. Wang Chao, we have had a lot of things. Gurjus, motor Mail 
。所以，让我们不要忘记今天，让我们找每一刻的美丽。在菲尔泽，早车就是打造生活。我们用最棒的意大利西贡，美丽的车子给美丽的生活。我们的车很快，但也适合很慢，有时候慢，也快好。所以现在，让我们活着美丽的人生，未来在等亲未来。菲亚特，人生如此美丽。La vita è bella. This means life is beautiful. This means that although our cars go fast, they can go slow too. And you know, for Italians, sometimes that is even better. Italians drive incredibly fast, but they also like to stop. And enjoy a long, a long lunch break,、uh, look at a painting, or smell a flower. And I don't think it's bad. It is an innocent appreciation of the little things: an espresso, a cappuccino, a simple moment. It's about finding joy in the moments that are lost in the symphony of a busy city. That's why Fiat has always designed cars that give you a smile, style that delivers pleasure. At a glance, engines that are designed to leave our children a better planet, interiors that delight you with typical Italian craftsmanship of a stitch or the touch of a perfect cut of leather. Of course, the celebration of details is not foreign to China, but it's a tradition that has given Italy its greatest names, names that, by the way, go beyond cars. Names that you will find in the boutique of both the Champs Elysees and Wan Fu Jing. Italian names that you will find now not only in two beautiful buckles and leathers, but also on a car like the Fiat 500 Gucci. The Fiat 500 by Gucci. I love that we are bringing it to this market because it's a perfect ambassador of Italian refinement in the most refined of cultures. Just look at the sophisticated alloy wheels. Look at the Gucci. Uh, green and red stripes. Look at the details, like Gucci leather, the double G on the wheels, on the gear shift knob. These everyday items have been transformed into jewelry. We believe that everything on this 500 feels tailor-made. Tailor-made like the launch film brought to us by the Gucci team, which I want to thank here. It's not a commercial. It's a short movie shot by Alexi Tan, an up-and-coming director from Hong Kong. For a brand that is up and coming here, I'd like to share with you a little trailer of this film. Alexis' movie captures the spirit of a legend, and in my opinion, if Fiat 500 has become a legend all over the world, it's because, like no one else, it's tailored to suit any in,、uh, unique individual, in the most individual of manners. Like this other Fiat 500, the Fiat、uh, 500 convertible. This car is a real tribute to the original Fiat 500. In 1957, actually, the first Fiat 500's owner. Could enjoy the pleasure of open-air driving, a little car that already gave you more, more fun, more joy, and more of the sky above. And today, the 500C gives you more technology, more safety features, in the form of seven airbags and ESP, and of course, more fuel efficiency. Because simply more is a formula that fuels the Fiat brand. It is a commitment that runs from the narrow streets of Turin. Through the endless avenues of Shanghai and Beijing, it is a long journey, as we say in Italian, a viaggio, a journey taking knowledge from several continents and bringing it together as a Fiat built in China, a Fiat named Viaggio, for both the path that led it here and the road that you will want to take in it. It is built on the world-class platform of the Alfa Romeo Giulietta, a platform that also. That is also impressing American journalists、uh, in the new Dodge Dart. It carries the world-class technologies of the Fiat and Chrysler groups, because this is a car that represents our commitment to the Chinese market. This is a car that proves 
that the Fiat Group has learned and is here to stay.